But we begin with the governor's new mandated travel order. Good Friday evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us for Western Mass News 11 at 11. I'm Chris Pisano. Governor Charlie Baker now requiring travelers observe a 14-day quarantine coming to the Bay State from anywhere outside the Northeast and Hawaii. Western Mass News reporter Leon Purvis speaking to some travelers tonight, and he joins us now live from our MGM studio with more. Leon. Chris, some folks say this is needed. Others think it's pointless. And someone from the hospitality industry says this travel restriction may not impact them much at all. On Friday, Governor Charlie Baker issued an executive order on travel. Baker saying if you come from outside New England, New York, New Jersey, or Hawaii, you must fill out a Massachusetts travel form and quarantine for 14 days. Travelers can avoid quarantine with the proof of a negative coronavirus test within the past three days. Uh, I think it's necessary uh, primarily to stop the spread of the coronavirus. Tina Scurry is traveling from Albany, New York and heading to Connecticut to visit her son. She says someone coming from a high-risk area should stay put. It's airborne. Um, they don't need to be out in public. They don't need to interact with people. They need to social distance and just to make sure that they're healthy and those around them stay healthy. Those who come from a high-risk state and fail to file the new travel order could be fined up to $500 per day. But one traveler says a quarantine could be just as costly. Who can afford it, you know? I mean, take that time out of your schedule and where are you going to do it at? Paul Roy thinks this new travel order should not be in place. He believes it could hurt the economy. It's going to stop a lot of tourists. And it's going to stop business, you know, people coming to visit, people, you know. One hotel manager says they can't force people to quarantine. All they can do is tell them to check out the travel form on Mass.gov and fill it out. As far as the travel restriction hurting the hospitality industry, it may not make a difference for some. I don't know. I mean, occupancy has been down uh, quite a bit anyway, so I don't know how much more it's going to affect. This new order goes into effect on August 1st. We'll have more details on that on our website, westernmassnews.com. Live in Springfield, Leon Purvis, Western Mass News.